Hello everyone and welcome back to the Four Immortal Sisters Challenge and I have given the kiddies, the kiddies, the kiddies room a little bit of a makeover. It is not complete by any manner of means but I am pushed for time today but I thought it was time that both Audrey and Seymour had their own beds. So I've kind of done this, I've changed the theme to something a little bit older and I've put my fancy Nancy curtains in with a curtain pole and I took this camp teddy and made it bigger. Don't you wish you could make everything bigger in real life? So, especially wads of cash. So, hope you're all having an amazing day, whatever you're up to. Seymour is eating his breakfast. I think he's eating some leftover uh, scrambled eggs. And uh, he's sitting looking at a disgusting, spoiled lot of scrambled eggs. Not too cute. Everyone else is still in bed, apart from Marissa, who has just got up. And she's bursting. She's bursting. We'll go for a pee. It seems that every episode starts with someone going for a pee. Someone is always desperate for a pee. Yes, they are. And you need to get up, Lady Pie, because you have school and you need to take yourself a shower. School starts in an hour. She is doing super duper well at school. She has the gold tick and her performance is green. Seymour, not so much, but then of course he is younger. So we'll see what happens with him. I need you to get changed. Change into your everyday outfit. Okay, so she's going to swap in between them and then clean up the scrambled eggs. Now, she does want to see her lovely friend again, Mr. Simon. Even though Simon isn't that interested in her, she still wants to see him. So, um, I think we'll do that today. Tara, how are you? You are hungry. So, once we have uh, a little Miss Marissa clean that up, we'll get her to cook and serve some breakfast. We'll do eggs and toast. Eggs on toast, eggs on toast, Kentucky Fried Chicken in a Pizza Hut. <laughs> That's so not the tune, is it? No, it is really not. Right, she's doing the to oh, Have you broke the toilet? Well, since we have money, we'll just replace it because we are loaded. Right, come and tell Seymour a make believe story. And if you remember in the last episode, Fia is now pregnant once more with a third child and uh, it is by Mr. Jensen. I don't know what it's going to look like because as you can see, Jensen, he's not the prettiest apple on the tree, but he'll do. <laughs> he'll do. I see we're just grabbing himself some orange juice because obviously scrambled egg wasn't enough for our little munchkin. Go to the toilet and uh, don't take a bath. Don't take a bath. Go go do that. Go take a bath. Do pee. I don't think he's going to have enough room. I think the, I think the, what do you call it's going to come? What do you call it? Yes, the what do you call it? Did you not go? Wait, so you better not be outside morning or I will. Oh my lord. I asked you to make some breakfast and you're outside morning, Leslie. Are you off your head? lady. I know that I have said many times that we are going to, no, or are you, be, uh, are you going to, no, she's just going to drink, that's fine. Go and have a shower, Aura. Just, just while things are getting sorted. I've said many times that I was going to make this graveyard and I still need to do it. <laughs> I do still need to do it because um, Miss Marissa here is super duper, she's just so nice, isn't she, that she just gets really upset. Right, I need you to come out here and go to the toilet at school, but get to school. Your performance is not that good anyway, Mr. Seymour, so it is not that great. Let's, when Audrey's at school, let's get her to make some friends, because her social need is down a little bit. You better not be going to grab something. Something will be ready in a moment. What is it with people? Just go and take a shower or something. Go ahead. Go on. Okay, Jensen, where are you? He's feeling particularly flirty. He wants to cloud gaze with Fia. He wants to embrace her. Little do you know, Jensen, she wanted you for one thing. Ah, uh, well, two things. <laughs> one thing is a booby. Second thing is a chance to see Mr. Grimmy again. Hopefully we'll get to see him in this episode. And thank you. Oh, yeah, guys. Oh, yeah, we will. We will. We will. We will. Is Fia all, is she looking all cute? Is she looking all cute? Well, we'll not feed him until she's had something to eat. She's, she is super cute today. She is looking feisty in her green stuff. 
Okay, Audrey has met Hugh when at school. Wonderful. Jensen, come and get a last meal. Before you are eaten, I will feed you your last meal. <laughs> oh my god, she was going to eat the cake. No, don't do that. Go and grab a serving of that. Um, Where is... Are you out your shower yet? Come and get something to eat. So, yeah, we'll, we'll let him have his last meal. <laughs> she knows. She's like that. I'm sitting there in private position. So get her to actually text him and let him let him know that uh, that uh, something is a coming. Um, let's send him a little text. A little naughty text. Did you not eat it, sweetheart? I told you to eat. Are you totally, like, trying to mess up this plan? Okay, good stuff. 186 simoleones. Wonderful. We do need to get Terra once she has finished her breakfast to work on the garden. And we will get Aura to go in and write stuff or paint stuff or just make some money in general. So let me know in the comments below, guys, what you have been up to this week so far. We are at Thursday, or it will be when you see this. So you've had most of the week and tomorrow is Friday, which I know is everyone's favourite day of the week or at least most people's favourite day of the week. Um, so let me know what you're getting up to. I hope that you enjoyed my live stream. Um, I have decided that my live stream schedule is going to be on a Sunday, a Monday and a Thursday. That's going to be my live stream days, but I will update you guys with um, actual times and stuff later on. Right, are you finished? Yes, you are. Go to the toilet then. You don't want to be peeing yourself in front of old Grimmy. No, you do not. You do not. Yeah, so I'll let you know about the actual schedules. No, don't, don't be going to eat the cake. No, no, no. And don't mourn Leslie. Don't mourn her. Don't mourn her. Come and repair this because that's something that you need to be doing. Let me know if you actually attended the live stream. I hope you did because it was fun. No, do I purchase flaming seeds? Harvest all. Orbadag. Okay, let's go. Let's eat some cake. Yeah, we've got another egg. Woo! Oh, it's time. It's time for you to meet your maker. It's time. No, you can't clean that up. You're going to have to leave that alone. I want you to go and sell that, please. Oh, Jensen. <laughs> oh poor Jensen and here he is oh I'm too sexy for my knife that sounds really bad what do you call that is it a scythe or I don't know what you call it I can't believe he's like locking him in in the iPad do you realise who is here no we're not pleading for Jensen but 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 come here go here go here I want you to take a picture of him right go Let's take a picture of Grimmy in his iPad. <laughs> take a photo of the Grim Reaper. I wanted to take a photo with him as well. I don't know if we've managed to get a photo with him and her. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. I wish I could get, yeah, I can get the two of them in. That is so funny. She's like that, what? She actually looks like she's a little girl in trouble. That. <laughs> like she's like oh, it looks like she peed but I know she hasn't like what's wrong with you let's get his finger in okay there's only so many pictures you can take clearly she's like hey baby I really do like her outfit do you like it I like it I think it's cute I like the green on her it suits her Right, remember and don't go away, Grimmy. She's like, don't go, please, don't go. Look at her. <laughs> Tara, what's up with you, babe? What's up with you? Can you continue on with your uh, tending your garden? I would really like that. That would be great. Go and weed. Weed. Oh, God, here's another one. Here's another one. And there you go. Right. Can we talk to him yet? <gasps> Why is he not letting me talk to him? 
Right, I know he's dead. Right, I'm sorry. Poor Jensen. Blah, blah, blah. Yakety, yakety. Uh, discuss interests. Oh, he came right over to her there, guys. He came right over to her. Right, come on. I don't think I have managed to get a selfie. Let's try. Take photo with... Grimmy. Oh, Arba. <laughs> like she's just got such a like a such a cheeser like hi I too sexy for my shirt yeah let's do that that's cute cute adorable right ask him to hang out let's please hang out with me how do we do that? Express their admiration. I just want to like put these up here so that um flatter a romance. Let's offer him a rose. Let's flirt. Let's make some progress in this relationship. Because he is... Oh, sorry, I had to move my chair there, guys. Let's make some progress. Don't anybody come in and have a group conversation. Oh, he's liking it. He's liking it. He's like that. Oh, oh. Hold on, two ticks, two ticks. Okay, sorry, I was going quiet there because I'm like totally engrossed. I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, he's going to love her and then love us and then we'll be people with Grammy. Yeah, I was getting so engrossed there. <laughs> That's the first time in a Let's Play I've ever been like so engrossed that I'm like, oh my God, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Let's kiss his hands. Come on, we can do this. Let's uh, compliment his appearance. And let's flirt a little bit more. Come on, you can do it, Fia. Seduce death. You can do it. He's loving it. He is loving it. He is feeling super flirty. Oh, he's loving it. He's loving it. Let's compliment him again. An amorous exchange. Let's do a sexy pose. <laughs> Let's um, compliment him again. I don't know. I've never seen like a kiss with the Grim Reaper, so I don't even know if it's possible. But can you woohoo? No. Take him over. It's a steamy exchange, so take him over to the bedroom. Would you like to come and sit on my sheets? Oh, don't go. Oh, he's away. I'll tell you, this will be the hardest the hardest fought <laughs> romance ever in the history but she made progress she is charming the reaper she is charming the reaper so that's good so what i think we will do what i think we will do is get terra to come and milk the cow milk the cow and we're going to get marissa marissa for the love of god what's this she feels ouch from repairing <laughs> Well, do you know what'll make you happy? Phone Simon and ask Simon to come make you happy. Even though he's totally refused you and dished you and doesn't actually want you. But I'm sure that he likes you as a friend and it'll be good for her to have like a best friend, I think. Because she's kind of stuck in the house a lot. So it'll be nice for her to just have someone, you know. She's sad as well because she witnessed death. And she's just sad because remembering a sim that passed away <laughs> she really is just the cutest isn't she right simon let's flatter him a little bit audrey has met tyrone at school so audrey is actually just loving up audrey is meeting all the boys let's compliment his outfit oh he's angry why are you angry simon okay so simon's not having a good day so let's try and brighten his day a little bit um, excuse me? Simon. Why are you being offensive? Let's try and calm him down. We're not going to apologise because we've not done anything 
Seriously? Are you kidding me on, Simon? <gasps> what is wrong with you? Simon, I'm not happy with that. I am not happy with that at all. And Aura would not be happy with that. Aura would be raging. I can't believe you're actually speaking to our sister like that. <laughs> She's like that. Who the hell do you think you are? Guys, I need to kick his ass. I'm sorry. Like, I actually need to do it. Like, he was horrible to her. I actually thought that Simon was quite a nice guy, but clearly freaking not. <laughs> She's telling him off as well now. She's like, don't you come around here. Oh dear. I think you should leave. <laughs> She's like that. Nope. How dare you? What are you doing? This isn't this isn't going well for old Simon. Okay. So she's gonna try and, and calm try and calm the situation down because she's not like, oh my god, Terra's now coming to give him any trouble. This man is in trouble. Okay. No idea why he is being an ass. But she's trying to calm him down a little bit. So is that helping? Is that helping? <laughs> Right, ladies, let's let's see if he, she can make him feel a little bit better. Let's um, see if we can take this somewhere away from the situation. So come and sit together with Simon. Come on. Right, come and sit with him. Well, she's so sad. And then he just came over and shouted at her. It's like a nightmare. Poor her. Right, you go do your homework, sweetheart. And if you could do your homework as well, that would be amazing. Okay, let's let's try and make up this friendship. What the hell went on? I will never know why he's so angry at her. That is ridiculous. Let's uh, talk about cooking. <laughs> he's like just became a complete different person. Right, okay. Okay. I think you guys need to go and leave them to it. So come out of the group chat you need to water your plants and you need to go and sell this please and leave these two to try and have a nice conversation uh, she's still watching him she's like i'm watching you i am watching you you be nice to my sister or i'm gonna kick your ass yeah, so the acquaintances again because he was angry, but he seems to be happy now. <laughs> so apparently three women shouting at him has made him happy. Okay, fair enough. I think we can recoup this. We can recoup this. He, he just was having a bad day. I mean, we've all had a bad day at some time or other. <laughs> you doing your homework, my little darling? You are. You are. Good girl. Good girl. Proud of you. Maybe all he needed was to get his frustrations out and then he might actually end up, you know, loving her a little bit. <laughs> well, this is going quite well. I think if it continues, he might have to be uh, sacrificed, I think. Okay, well, they're having a nice conversation. Hey, Seymour, how are you getting on? I get, I get the impression that Seymour isn't quite as bright as Audrey. Can she help him with his homework? Nope. I don't think she can. What is your um thing? So play instruments for five hours. So go and do that. Because remember we are desperately trying to cr get these uh, prodigy things going. So if you can play that, that would be awesome. And you, my darling, what do you need to do? You need to play in a jungle gym. I don't know if... We could probably, actually, we could probably afford a jungle gym, but I don't really know how they get playful. Let's see if we could actually afford a jungle gym for him. A jungle gym, 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 jungle gym, gym, gym. Where's the, where, where the freak? Will it be in outdoor activities, I would imagine? Outdoor. Outdoor activities. Is this class is a jungle gym? It is. Let's go for red beards. Wow, it's big. Let's go for the pirate ship. Now, I know it's a big investment, but ultimately, 
you know, could we pick this up? Yes. Okay, we have five deaths. <laughs> we have murdered five people. How evil are we guys? Like seriously? Well, how evil am I? <laughs> so I'm the one that's done it. Right, so once he's done that, we can... What are you doing? Are you helping him with that? No, you can't. You can't. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I know that that's a super sweet thing, but you can't do that. That's not your job. She's probably like, what? I was only trying to help. <laughs> so I know if you play in the, or take a play in the Jets, I think that makes you um, playful. So go and repair this. Yeah, next episode, I promise I will have this taken care of because uh, she cannot deal. She cannot deal. And Fia is in her first trimester still. She's going into the second trimester in six hours. <laughs> She's not very good at that, is she? She needs to get to creativity level 10 to get the prodigy thing. And she's currently at 6. Um, I think 7 soon. So she's not too bad. Not too bad, I don't think. Which is good. Right, so once he's playful, then he can go and play on the jungle gym, I think. Marissa has got the plumbing upgrade part. Well done. Marissa, I'm so proud of you. Like, seriously. Let's um, put away and let's go ahead and get her to clean up. She gets all the good jobs, doesn't she? <laughs> she really does. She gets all the good jobs. Are you playful yet? Why are you not playful? Okay, well, well actually, is it if you play with toys, am I right? Open, play, oops, oops. Open, play. Right, come and uh, play and play. Then hopefully that makes him playful. You would think. You would think. She just needs to play her instrument. She's played for four hours, so that's good. <laughs> Poor Marissa's going to be like, oh my god, my head is busting. <laughs> Okay guys, that's time up. So thank you so much for joining me. The Duck of Doom has now sounded. But I hope that you enjoyed this episode and let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on Simon. What the heck went on with him? I know he was angry, but how different was he? Crazy. And uh, yeah, let me know how you're getting on in the comments below. I always love to hear from you. And please, if you could leave a like on this video, it really does help um, a lot. So that would be awesome if you could do that. And I love you loads, guys. Bye.